Hello, friends and neighbors. Welcome to another production of the program. Here we are on TV once again, once a day, every day. Turn on the machines and live forever. Here we go. I'm alive. I made it all the way back to Wednesday. It's the first Wednesday of the next uh, second ten years. And we're, we're making it around. I don't know how many days can I count. You know, I remember back uh, when, when James and Heather were coming on the Mondays back in maybe January or December. I think it must have been December. And we're like, oh, it's your fifth day back. And then, you know, eventually you stop counting at some point. So this is our first, our first time, like, after Wednesday. But whatever, I guess we're still counting these days. I say, what day have we been? How long have we been doing this? I lost track, but I didn't lose track now because we're at 3658. My friends out there in TV land, thank you for joining me in this very difficult time. You can call the number up there. It's 360-836-4384, or you can get on to the Zoom. That's what I'm doing. Uh-oh, I'm, right, I'm doing that right now. I'm going to go to the... Uh, YHWM.com, and, and that's where the Zoom link it is called. That's still how I do it. Maybe there's better ways, but I don't know. And then we can get on there. Uh, now I'm on there, so if anybody gets on there, then they can start talking to me, and we'll see if that happens. Uh, I'm going to get to the thing, but I'm not going to. You know what I'm doing right now? not looking at the phones because who's on the phone sometimes there's things on the phones um you know towards the beginning of this whole thing about being in the basement i was going right to the phones and because maybe i think well freddie was on there a lot and the people were on the zoom so i was like i'm gonna get right on the phones and see how this is going but before that like when we we're in the studio i was doing this thing where i was trying to say things for a while before i even looked at the messages because it's like once I start looking at the messages, and then I'm going to be getting into that whole thing, and, like, it's, it's probably better to just try to say stuff first, and that's what we're doing right now, saying stuff. You know what I'm doing? I'm talking. Uh, uh, last, yesterday on the program was Tuesday, uh, Freddy was there on the Zoom, we were talking about, uh, we're talking to Mark a good amount about vegetables and categories. And we end, I remember we ended up going a little bit long because I was because Freddie thought that potatoes were legumes, and legumes definitely not potatoes, beans and peanuts, uh, and maybe peas. Maybe peas are legumes, but you know it depends. Beans, green beans, not green beans though, because there's beans and then there's green beans and there's peanuts, and peanuts are not. Nuts, I guess. Peanuts are legumes, even though they call peanuts, and they go and mix nuts. So it's like you put tomatoes go into tomato vegetable soup, and so does corn. But neither of them maybe are vegetables. But peanuts are legumes, maybe not nuts necessarily, even though the name is nuts are in in peanuts. But they go into mixed nuts. You can put peanuts in mixed nuts, but maybe they're not even nuts at all. They're beans. Maybe peanuts are beans, but maybe you have boiled peanuts and then they're soft like beans and sometimes you can get crunchy uh beans like you dry them out and they're crunchy like peanuts and they are kind of like peanut like when they're dried out so it's uh it's it's categories peanuts peanuts legumes beans green beans peas corn who knows what that stuff is i did find out that beans i guess you can't eat beans beans are carbs that's what they say at least those people, we should talk to Sean Downey about keto diet. People are always doing this keto diet, but I think it might be related to diabetic ketoacidosis, which would make sense to me because uh, keto diet is like the carbs, and carbs is basically turns into sugar, I guess. So anything that turns into sugar, so then you can get diabetic ketoacidosis. So it's got the word keto in it, but I don't know if keto is like some guy, if it's like Atkins or if it's like keto because of like, like diabetic ketoacidosis. It seems like it might fit in there. Uh, I'm not really sure even what that is when it, but it's, it's, I think it's not good probably when you get that. I think it's when you start failing. When you, I think I think diabetic ketoacidosis might be when when you get too bad of diabetes and you start having organ failure. So 
makes sense that it's like the word keto is in there because they're trying to avoid it and I guess they're trying to lose weight so if you lose weight with the no carbs thing I think Dan Bennett was on well he was not not quite keto I guess he was like onto some low carb diet which is like stealth keto which is probably better keto those keto people should be eating a little bit of it some people don't eat or just don't eat anything at all if you're really trying to lose weight just don't eat for a while don't eat every people eat a lot of food it's just like eat less food in general that's I think the best diet if you're trying to just lose weight just like no more food just like take a take a day off take it only eat every couple of days I think people eat a lot you know snakes they don't eat that much but they're they're built for it I think but uh I don't know other foraging animals are they eating every day lions the lions eat every day it's hard to know they gotta they chase around they gotta kill every single day they get one of those antle uh, uh, antelope you think they're getting an antelope every single day maybe they're getting some, some rabbits on some days or something but I don't know if there's rabbits in the lion zone like if you're a lion looking for food every day you're gonna have to settle for other things but I've seen cats that like to eat bugs those are the house cats though but I don't, maybe lions might not even be aware of bugs like they're pretty big uh, I mean how much bigger is a lion than a cat because lions are bigger than me but I'm definitely aware of small bugs are the lions twice as big as me because they can see those tiny bugs there I think like I've seen like a fly and then like those tiny flies they're probably only like a quarter of the size of a regular house fly with those tiny fruit flies and I'm aware of those so maybe lions if they're double my size are aware of regular sized flies or maybe especially large flies or sp spiders or something I think they might be eating bugs I've seen lots of cats eat bugs and lions are cats so they probably like bugs or anything moving maybe lions are just eating anything that moves but not each other or maybe like smaller cats or something I don't know they get to decide on what they want to eat and they're gonna go after bugs or I don't know they're not gonna eat plants lions I don't know what kind of plants anything else is eating though like the antelope they're eating wild grass seems like they eat grass like what a deer eat is it grass Deer kind of like look like kind of cows. People eat them. They taste like a cow. I've eaten a deer before, and cows are or deer are going around. They eating leaves or they eating wild grass. There's not a whole lot of wild grass. I don't know where deer's are eating ferns. I don't know. Animals will eat meat though. I think if you feed a, a deer, I don't know. Deer's gonna turn down meat. I never really had a rabbit. I think rabbits eat primarily vegetables but I think all the plants I've ever had are most are dogs and cats it's the only ones I've ever fed anyway and fish I don't know what fish food is fish food like those flakes that just come in the flakes and it's kind of salty it's like what a fish what do fish eat bugs but water bugs well, there's like deep water if you go into the ocean like are there bugs in the ocean there's lots of bugs up here tons of bugs I thought I heard that most animals are bugs or most of the biomass is bugs but is there water bugs there's like krill krill is like tiny shrimp I guess shrimp shrimp and spy uh, like lobsters are pretty much bugs uh, big bugs so if there's lobsters or like tiny lobsters or maybe there's are like baby lobsters because I think most of those animals have tons of babies so maybe there's just like tiny 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 shrimp something which are basically bugs or like sea bugs but it's like if they're under if they live underwater can they be bugs like I don't know I don't know if they can be bugs I think if you're underwater it's like you if you live primarily underwater then it's like no longer a bug it's like some kind of other thing uh, it's definitely a lot of microscopic stuff in there I don't know if the fish are just like eating the, but they're not filtering fish aren't filtering but they're eating something there's a lot less plants the ocean is not very many plants like up here tons of plants but in the ocean like if you're far off and most of the world is the ocean but they're getting like in the ocean there's not that many plants but maybe there's a lot of sea sludge like or is like what's the base of life in the ocean it's not plants maybe it's plankton is it well plankton's not 
uh, algae. Is it algae? Is this like so much algae in the in the, or is it just like the bacteria or something? I don't know the underground, underwater stuff. Seems something, something's down there. They're eating something. What do lobsters eat? They filter in there. They're eating. Clams eat filter. Clams eat the filter, whatever, like, is just, like, floating in the water. They're eating bacteria. But I don't know what lobsters eat, but they must feed them something, that red lobster. Or if they just got, like, a, 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 a powder or, like, like a fish, like, fish powder they put in there. I've never seen that. I don't know anybody that's ever worked at a, maybe a grocery store. It's like, have you ever worked in a grocery store? Who's worked at a grocery store or a Red Lobster from the program that we can ask about lobsters and say, you were fed a lobster? I'm never fed a lobster before. Hey, hello, hello, Mr. Ginsu, you are fed a lobster? You are fed a lobster? Mr. Ginsu, Mr. Ginsu has a good amount of fish experience though because he was a fisherman for a long time so maybe he has experience with feeding lobsters crabbing are you on a crab boat or a fish boat on the deadliest I, I i'm i kind of like am led to believe that he was on some kind of like deadliest catch kind of fishing ship where it was kind of dangerous and and he was like having to fight the currents and live out there and be uh, like a salty like that's why he he ended up Mr. Ginsu is a salty sailor if you wonder like how he ended up being all uh crass and crass but with a heart of gold I think it's because he was he's a sailor or something like oh, he's kind of a pirate <laughs> Mr. Ginsu is kind of like a pirate in a way um see the pirates they're not they're not cursing if you think about a pirate it's like but it seems like pirates would be pretty crass and cursing all the time but pirates are mostly for kids these days they used to be like you know nasty criminals and they were you know doing bad things but now they're like kids for kids oh well, in the future oh man it's kind of for kids now anyway like 90s gangbangers or something like like uh, become they become like a a uh, a story like something you dress up as, or are they still doing that? Like I don't know. I wonder what the are the uh, the gangs still looking like? I think they look like, or I think I have an antiquated idea of what they look like. Seems like they would have changed their looks by now, and maybe um, like gangsters could go the way of pirates. From like '90s ones, anyway. I guess something like they look like a uh, like gangster rap, <laughs> like like um, Cypress Hill or something. Like the people, the gang, the gang, gang people still look like Cypress Hill. Messages. Anybody on there? I'm loading it up now. Mm hmm. Oh, we did. We got some messages. Oh, man, Mr. Ginsu and Freddy. Freddy left the message, right? And Mr. Ginsu left several messages. This is a Freddy message. Hey, program. This is Freddy. I, I was calling back because of yesterday we were talking about um, potatoes. I thought that potatoes were legumes, and you said they were not legumes, and you were absolutely right. I was confused. Uh, but potatoes are tubers, which is like a whole other subset, I guess. Um, still can't decide whether... All of these things are vegetables, or, and like each of these things, like tubers and 
uh, legumes and all these things are just like a subset of vegetables or if there's some other classification. But anyway, I hope you have a good program. Um, talk to you later. Oh, 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 where'd you go? You don't follow us. Huh? That was weird. Oh, yep. Oh, why'd you leave? Where'd you, you go? go? You coming back? I saw ya. Remember, call him. Come back, yo, ball. I was going to acknowledge you after the message. Oh, there you are. You're back. Hello. Hello, yo, fellow. Hi. Hi, how are you? You're back. I don't like having my uh, my name on the screen. You can't see my my name. We can see your name. You got to take it off your your username. How do you do that? You change your username. Hmm. It's going to be on there if you um uh yeah. How are you? How are you? I'm doing good. How are you? I'm I'm okay. Uh, you yeah. think that potatoes are vegetables? Yeah. No, they're tubers. Huh? They're root vegetables. They're root vegetables. Yeah. Yeah, it counts as root vegetables. But it's like, you know, the thing is, like, I'm always thinking about this. Like, you're gonna eat. They say, hey, do you, are you eating your vegetables? And you're like, oh, yeah, I eat a lot of vegetables. But like, all you're eating potatoes. Like, that doesn't, you can't do that, you know? Yeah. Very weak connection. All right, I guess we'll call Freddy. I'm gonna listen to all those Mr. Instant messages. All right, Fre oh, I'm gonna listen to Freddy's message anyway. Yeah, you want to try just only calling with the voice? Maybe it might work better on the Zoom if you don't use the video. Let me see. Let me see. Hi, you've reached Freddy Dobler. I can't come to the phone right now, but if you leave me a nice message, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks a lot. Beep. Uh, Freddy, I don't know where the beep is. But, uh, yeah, tubers, huh? Root vegetables. What about carrots? Are carrots tubers, too? Uh, like, there's carrots and there's potatoes, and they're really close together. And there's sweet potatoes. Sweet potatoes are, um, not, are potatoes, but carrots aren't potatoes. But they might as well be, like, what's the difference between carrots and potatoes if you've got sweet potatoes? Because sweet potatoes are kind of like between carrots and uh, potatoes. So, I used to make carrots into, into fries. Carrots do have that, like, core that potatoes don't have, I guess. And potatoes can be different shapes. The potatoes and carrots. What about garlic? And onions, too. Our onions grow under the ground, don't they? Are they tubers? But what about garlic? Does garlic grow under the ground? Where does garlic grow? I've never seen a garlic plant. Uh, well, I don't know what happened, Freddy. Am I leaving you a message right now, even? Or <laughs> not? I think I might not even be leaving you a message. Yeah. What the heck? Weird things are happening today. Alright. Alright, let's get back to these messages. 
<laughs> Mr. Ginsu left several messages. Four messages. And I think they're going to be three minute long messages each. So that means... What? Uh, three times twelve minutes of messages. If I think... If I'm right about what I think is happening, I think we're going to have twelve minutes of messages from Mr. Ginsu. That's a good t amount of time. That'll get us... About... You know, 12 minutes plus some other time. 35 minutes, then we'll have 20 minutes left. So, if you call 505-370-5764, you will get Amazon, supposedly Amazon um, Dispute Department. And I called that number, he's like, Oh, this number, we have somebody getting an iPhone 11 somewhere in, Cal in California. And um, I'm like, no, I'm not in California, and that ain't me. You're just going to have to go fraud if they think that's, that's my phone number, but that ain't me. And so they say, okay, we're going to fucking turn them motherfuckers in. We'll go get them. We'll go right to wherever they fucking was going to get that fucking package delivered, and we're going to arrest them on the fucking spot, motherfuckers. That's going to be fucking funny when they get to do that. Well, Mr. Goose is getting frauded, I guess. What the fuck? Over. What the fuck? You gotta be fucking kidding me, motherfucker. That Trump motherfucker. China. 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 Oh, fuck. Them poor people over in China. They're a bunch of motherfucking communist motherfuckers, you know? You can't be a smart communist hardly because fucking. You ain't fucking free. <laughs> yep. That's the only way to do it. If you ain't free, Jesus is a freaking sucker. Well, you don't have a choice if you're communist. Oh. They, they fucking will fucking kill your ass. As far as I fucking even care. Yeah, they don't like a lot of shit. They don't like a lot of people. If they don't like it, they'll fuck you over. Kind of like that fucking cunt did to me way back when. Fuck me over. Thank you, cunt. Bye bye and your family, whatever. Later. Uh oh, spaghetti holes. <laughs> yeah, anyway, motherfucking that fucking cunt. And them motherfucking people over there in China. They didn't really have a choice. Only the upper echelons of the people who are in charge of the Communist Party we in charge. Mm -hmm. So. That's kind of how it is everywhere. And none of that bullshit really fucking matters. Because whatever it really did fucking matter, Trump fucking dropped the fucking ball. Up. I didn't know what the fuck I was doing, he would say. I don't trust in fucking science. I trust in, he trusts in God. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Now we're all fucked. He trusted somebody that got fucking crucified. <laughs> for most probably being a fucking child molester. <clears throat> then, yeah, it must have been God fucked that little girl, because, uh, wasn't me. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. And they went, oh. Yeah, okay. Uh, that's gonna work, so... Oops, well, we, we changed our mind. We're gonna crucify you instead because we don't believe you. Yeah, that's what fucking deal is, motherfuckers. Yeah. Hello? Hello? I'm gonna play the next message. I know where you want. Well, oh yeah, I guess we're gonna keep on going with these messages. Quiet. Oh, 
what the fuck, over. Hey. Um. What the fuck was I gonna say? Something about. Oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah. What does it feel about when. Are people supposed to pay the rent if they can? Or. Are people just supposed to not pay the rent and just use that money to live on and buy cars and shit? Yeah. Um, mm. And move out of state whenever you're done not paying us? You're going to move out of state. What the fuck? And how are we supposed to chase them people out of state and get the money back? Because uh, you know people just. You know, prying fucking money out of a goddamn turnip is fucking tough. Uh, so, the government, seems to me, the government, our government, and our just people in general go, oh, yes, somebody don't have to pay, nobody has to pay. Uh, Hello. If Hello. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? Good, how are Mr. You? G Mr. Gintz is ranting about the government. I, I caught some of that, yeah. He was recently, just, he was recently flipped. Voicemail? Yeah, it was a voicemail. I left several of them. He, he recently flipped, like, only months ago. He was a su Trump supporter. What is he now? Um, well, he, he is upset with Trump. I think, uh... For dropping the ball about the virus, I think, and that's probably mm. seems real. And now he's like he's apologizing because he he spent like a couple of years trash talking Nancy Pelosi really hard. He's, he's like Nancy Pelosi, blah, blah, blah. I don't like whatever, whatever. And I don't even you know no no one quite sure what Nancy yeah. Pelosi is doing. But uh, now he's apologizing. He's like all those years I was trash talking Nancy Pelosi. I was wrong. He admitted it. He's like so. Wow. I guess he's flipped. Now he's a hippie. One side of the aisle or the other. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Mr. Gensu is our main source for politics on the program. So, like... You're probably not going to do much better. Yeah. Yeah, nobody can do that much better. But, um... He was also talking about how... And just in the last message about how the people... Like... The, the people of China are the... Like, mostly not the leaders. And... You can get mad at countries, but it's like all oh, like, like, like there's like four people they're arguing with each other, and then everybody in the whole country is supposed to be like, oh, I'm mad too, like at, the, at all of them, like. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, I'm sick. Of the players we have at the moment. Huh? They've read there. I'm sick of the players we have, the the cast of characters that we have. Yeah, yeah. They're, they're, they're not. Um, I'm finding them very interesting anymore. Yeah, there's like billions of people, but there's like only like ten people who are the leaders of all these countries and doing all this stuff for some reason. It's very, at least in our country, it's all should very... be more gov. Yeah, how come it's not like more governor? It's like the president is doing so much. I guess the governors should be doing more, and they, they guess they are like locally and stuff. But like, we're yeah. pretty much like yeah. Europe at this point, because Europe has like the U EU or whatever. So we're like each state is like could be their own country, but for some reason. Or mm -hmm. so national. Yeah, as far as all the logistics of who really does what, like the governor and the like, you know, locally, what's happening politically, and I have probably like a, like a kindergarten understanding of the way. Oh yeah. Uh, things work. <laughs> yeah, but kindergarten they teach you pretty good though. It was about the branches and stuff. Do they? Yeah, I need to go back because I don't. I, th I feel like I have, like, a somewhat grasp about, like, the actual, like, general, but I don't know about, like, what's going on I right now. Have, I know we have the president, and there's different, like, houses and stuff, and the, you know. You know about the pre like, the, the, the Senate and the I Congress? Mean, there's, yeah, there's, I know there's, yeah, there's other places. Don't, don't you live, you live, like, in the city with the Constitution, is in the city, right? I did. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, but now you live on the farm. Now you're a farm boy. You don't need to, to go read the Constitution. But you could have gone and, like, yeah. read... You could have gone and read the actual Constitution, like, the physical document, if you wanted to, right? <laughs> like, I could have. I, I could have. Yeah. 
I don't know if all that stuff is in the Constitution. Uh, but now, now I have these goats here, and if I had to take care of the goats by myself, I probably couldn't do it. They'd probably die. Who's the Who's the governor of uh, Pennsylvania? I think it's Tom Wolf. You think? You're not even sure? <laughs> he's either that or he's like the mayor of Philadelphia. <laughs> you don't know who the, the governor is? No, I don't know who the mayor of Philadelphia is. I think it's... Some, yeah, I know what he looks like. No, I think I think Tom Wolf is the governor. I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty sure of that. Yeah. I actually, I live like, like maybe like 500 yards from the state capitol building actually, so... Oh yeah. Yeah. There? I can see the state capitol building like from my yard, so they're right out there. So I'm pretty close. I'm pretty physically close to the government. <laughs> Any angry mobs swarms in the. Oh yeah, I see. I've seen the 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 mobs. They they're out there. Like they're in my neighborhood. Like, uh, the 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 when when they were doing like the haircut, they wanted haircuts. I remember when people were really mad about haircuts. Like, mm-hmm. in like mm, May or June, like June yeah. maybe. No, April, May, June. Yeah, like before, before it must have been before Memorial Day because George Floyd was on Memorial Day because then the people were mad about haircuts, remember? Mm-hmm. Remember that? Mm-hmm. That was a weird kind time. Of, kind of. I, I don't really. I've, I've been spacing out here, which is very good. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Well, there's been like, it's like every month is its own decade this year. Yeah, I, I, I've, I've decided that. I, yeah, I, I, I did a selfish thing. I'm just I'm out here, and I'm I'm not paying attention. To that's good. No, that's how it is. You like, you could li- live on the farm, do your own thing. Like, why is there? It's like all the the world. Everybody's like global in the yeah. world, and nobody is. Nobody can be. It's like oh, I think it's too much, too much technology. We're all. It's like thinking too much about all this stuff. And yeah, yeah. If if like a guy in a tank rolls up, and like throws me in. The back of a, a van. Yeah. And then I just wake, and then I'm just in a, a padded cell, and I'm, um, and I'm stamping like license plates or whatever you do for the rest of my life, or if an angry mob marches down the driveway. Yeah, I think if either, if, either one. They're not gonna need no license po- plates if you get to the point where you're getting kidnapped. Like, gonna be like, are you licensed? And I'm like, no. Oh, well, there's no. Yeah. We're kind of living in a military feudal state. Um, how's the, how's the, the mob will come for me, or the the mob or the state will come for me. Either one. I'll, at least I had some quiet beforehand. Yeah. How's the how's the farm? It's good. There's goats and there's um trees. Uh, what? I, I I had I had some uh, corn on the cob. Um, yeah. Left over corn on the cob, and I didn't finish it and I brought it down to the chickens and they were pecking at it. They they like they liked it a lot. Um The goats yeah, eat the goats eat like uh I was talking about like what what do deer eat earlier. What do you think Oh I know what deer are eating. What? There's there's so many deer around here that uh, our neighbors have um well there's no there's cornfields on our property. But um yeah the corn they go onto the uh corn fields and they eat the corn. That's what the goats are eating around here. And they eat our flowers and our bushes that are trying to grow. They're eating deer eat flowers? They eat our our, our flowers out front. So they're eating like if they're out in the woods though, what are they eating? Wild flowers? I guess they're eating grass and But there's not that much grass. I don't know, I was just thinking you like go out in the woods and there's like not like just like grass like cows cows in the field they're eating the grass because there's lots of grass everywhere but in the woods there's not that much grass maybe there is and I'm, maybe they're eating yeah, it but goats if you uh, we have goats and the goats um, they're eating all the time they just they wake up and they go and munch and that's pretty much it they're just like eating any green stuff they're just like sea green mm-hmm. stuff and they eat it it's like and that's that's their whole day yeah, yeah. so you know you don't have to feed the goats because they just eat whatever's around? Well, no, and I mean, my stepfather, he'll, he, he takes care of the goats. <laughs> That's a funny sentence. <laughs> just, stepfather, he takes care but he feeds the goats like, like grass that you buy, or what, where is this, or? No, no, he, um, he, he has a grain. They, the, the, the goats eat grains? 
grain and different types of feed. Yeah. Because they can't just eat like the lawn. Can goats eat like the lawn? Cows are, are cows just eating the lawn? They're out there. Like, they're crunching on hay. Hey, but is hay is hay? What's in the lawn? No, I don't think so. No, there there are some cows next door. I can hear them. Yeah. When I'm walking outside sometimes. So there's like special. It's like cow grass. There's like field. There's like lawn grass and like cow grass or something. Mm-hmm. But then what's the what? I don't know. I'm always like, what the? Why do the people have lawns? It's like where did this like lawn plant oh, come from? I, yeah, I never want to have to worry about taking care of a lawn in my life. Yeah. So people like the lawn, but farmer, yeah, farm farmers don't have a lawn. I don't think so. You have a farm. You have you put you crops. Like if we have all these so lawns, it should be crops instead of lawns. A farmer that has a lawn also. They have because they have the farmhouse with the lawn, and then they have the farm outside the house, and they go mow the lawn. Yeah. But then they are they feeding the lawn clippings to the goats. I don't think so. It is to com- compost or something. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. But um, we we if there's like if I have banana, what's it called? The banana wrappers. <laughs> the peel. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's like you've seen the uh, pictures on the on the internet. They got bananas wrapped in plastic, and they're like, uh, they already have a uh, wrapper, like. Yeah, that I'm really. I, I took melatonin to help me go to sleep. Yeah, you tripping? <laughs> it makes me a zombie. Yeah. But I'm sorry, I ate too much melatonin, man. Uh, <laughs> I'm acting weird now. <laughs> like, this melatonin's really messing with me. Uh, the. It's kind of my only opportunity to party out here. What melatonin? Yeah. <laughs> I'm don't don't get too hard. Melatonin's a gateway drug. Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to learn all these strombolies, man. It's not easy. Strombolies? Yeah, all these strombolies. And, and what? Uh, What's uh, is that? Uh, a, is that like a cannoli? No, a stromboli. It's like it's like pizza dough, and it's like wrapped up in like a balloon. A <laughs> balloon? <laughs> a stromboli. It's like a it's like a big crust like dough balloon and the the ingredients for the pizza are in the inside of it like a calzone but like a really really thick calzone maybe i don't know what is it round like i'm so, you, you've never heard about a, you never heard of stromboli before i don't think so you've never even heard the word before yeah, yeah maybe it's like um yeah i don't know i mean i can kind of vaguely it's like you know mexican food is like it's like meat and like beans and rice and like the same kind of spices yeah. in different shapes. Mm-hmm. But they call it, they're like, oh, you want a burrito or a taco or a, you know, Mexican pizza? It's like, well, aren't they all like the same foods, but just like in different shapes? Yeah. And that's yeah, like Italian kind of food. It's like, oh, you want a pizza or a spaghetti or a cannoli or a stromboli yeah. or a ravioli? It's like. There's not really much food I get excited about anymore yeah uh, it, it's hard to be excited about anything it's just like we gotta you, you know but i think well i don't think that's true once you get think, beyond excitement though like it, once you're not like people i think that I, I feel like a lot of the people who are like they're like doing their, they're doing the life they're still like trying to hold like hold on to like restaurants and all this stuff it's like hmm. that stuff's not like People think that gonna like, have some joy or something. Just like eat your food. They're starving people. You know, just like eat, if you get food, like that's what you shouldn't be worried about having so much fun. People are like, I gotta have fun. Like, how? What? No fun? How could I not have fun? You know, like how could I not have extra excitement and joy? It's like, you don't need it. Don't want people to have fun, do you? Yeah. I think. Yeah, I don't. Too much fun. People. Just, we should both start fasting. Yeah, and, uh, I think about it, but I, um, I'm, I'm, I guess I'm, I like to eat, I do like to eat, I eat the same thing, though, but, I was talking about fasting you earlier, that'd be a fun actually. experiment for the show? Huh? Do you think that'd be a fun experiment for the show? To fast? Yeah. No, I get hangry pretty fast, <laughs> like, 
and I get actually I get kind of I've been calling I don't know what, if there's a word for it but I get kind of like depressed like if I don't eat food you know I'm like I'm like oh I'm I'm sad I don't know what's going on I'm like maybe I should eat <laughs> you know yeah. like probably depressed is the word yeah, definitely. It's just called depressed in general, but like, but it's like I'm not depressed. Like, it's not like it's like I just haven't eaten. Yeah. I don't really get angry usually. Usually, if I if like things that are gonna make me angry, they just make me sad. Things that would make me angry, you know, like if somebody's like mean or something, I'm just like, oh, that's a bummer. They <laughs> like, make me sad really quickly. So I just gotta eat. I gotta keep eating anyway. But uh, what I don't have anything else. If I don't eat, I guess. I mean, what else? <laughs> like. I guess that's a. Uh, I, I feed the cats. Yeah. There's a cat that just stays in the garage. That's such a farm thing. It's like a rat. Or a, they they chase the rats. Or, mouser, yeah. they call it. I think, right? And I got really sad today as I was in the garage with the cat because it got really excited being pet by me. Yeah. It's like, oh god, this like cat is like. And it just has like, what's it called? Um, when you're just alone all the time. I don't know, it's like it's in uh, solitary confinement. The cat is? Um. Yeah. Oh, you, you, I can't hear you. I don't know what happened, now you're frozen. Oh, can't hear you. Don't know what's going on. Connection problems. Oh, oh. can you hear me now? Oh, yes. I decided to do this fun thing tonight, um, where I, I eat a lot of chocolate before bed, so I'm going to see if I have fun dreams. Yeah, it's going to mess with your dreams. i got to send you my book. I'm going to send you a copy. A lot of these things are, I'm like going over them, but, um, the... Oh, how, how do I get that? I, I'll have to, I, I don't know, I'm not sure yet, but I haven't published it yet, but when I publish it, I'll let you know. Um, but, um, it's like, uh, when you dream, or I was talking about, like, you eat the food, and then you see, you, like, eat, eat food right before you go to sleep, and then you dream, and then you write down, like, your dream, and then the food you ate. And then you can try to, like, control your dreams through your diet or something, <laughs> like, whatever you eat right before you go to bed, see if it works like that, do some dream experiments. It's funny that you were on some sort of same wavelength, wavelength, because... I just, I went out of my way to eat a lot of chocolate tonight. Yeah. Going to sleep. And I was telling myself I'm going to have my notebook next to my bed so I can wake up and write things down. Because I've been having some really wild dreams here. And I mm. need to start remembering them better. I I started a dream book. I don't know, maybe it's stress, but it like makes you dream more or something. When you're trying to yeah. live in a, a fake world. Um... I, I'm living in a real world. I'm living... It feels pretty... <laughs> I've been working six days a week. I'm, like, burnt out. Um, You're doing, like, farm work? <laughs> no, I'm, I'm working in a restaurant nearby. Oh, you got a job? You got a new job? Yeah. When? I'm a server, um, like, two weeks ago. Oh, yeah? What kind of food is it? It's drum Oh, <laughs> yeah. Is it an Italian restaurant? No, it's like a, it's like an American restaurant. Uh, did you tell them that you, you uh, had went to waiter school? Bartender school. Oh, you went to bartender school, and then you went to like waiter school, weird waiter school. Oh, the training program. Yeah. yeah I told I told them I did a bunch of crap. Hey, yeah, can I? I did a bunch of crap. Um, what's the what's yeah, the, what's today's there's special? No there's no specials. There's oh yeah. Menu. But you, you're like they're like sitting down, and you're like writing stuff on the on the notepad. You're like, hi, nice, like, hi, I'm I'm Yelf. I'll be your server today. Can I get you started with some drinks? Well, I'm in training. Oh yeah, another training, huh? Yeah. When do they get to? When do you yeah. get the notepad? I have the notepad because sometimes I'll I'll take orders. Still. Yeah. And then they're I like, oh. it's like masks. Masks time that you were like wearing the mask, taking the orders. Mm -hmm. I mean, they're not wearing a mask. A Trump, I see a lot of Trump stuff out here. And in, in the farm areas, yeah, it makes I sense. It. That's like uh, the I weird. Uh, it's like the p whole politics thing. Like everybody's always like, they're like, no matter what you do, 
or what you say, you're always going to be preaching to the choir. Like, mm -hmm. you can't change. I don't care. Like, yeah. I really don't care when I see, like, a guy walking with a Trump hat. Like, I think Biden's just as stupid at this point, honestly. Or, uh, yeah, I mean, that makes me so special, but I'm not going to vote. I have to say, I'm not going to vote. You're just not going to vote? Yeah. Uh, what, is, what is Pennsylvania? What did it, where did it go in 2016? Hmm? Was it red or blue in 2016? I don't know. You don't even know? <laughs> um, the, uh, yeah, but it's like the farm, people in the farms, people in the cities, they're separate. It's like so separated, like physically separated, and there's no, there's nothing. It's all, it's all over. <laughs> it's doom or doomed, either way, you know, it's like, uh, but nobody wants to, you're not supposed to say that, I guess. But, uh. Did I have a civil war or something, it seems like. Yeah. I'm actually actively concerned about, like, social upheaval, <laughs> like... You should be. It's, it's a shitstorm. Yeah. And, uh... And then again, but I'm, I mean, I'm, I work in food service, too. It's, like, I'm, like, kind of worried about uh, social upheaval, but then I'm still just, like, making food <laughs> out of place. Um, That's the thing. The majority of Americans are going to be, like, well, I still just want to stay home and... You know, I'm watching something. Yeah. <laughs> Stromboli! They got spaghetti there? No. At, at the place? Just Strombolis? No, I don't want to give away too much. Because I mean, you think somebody's going to go find your, your restaurant? Yeah. Yeah. Um. God, a nightmare happened today. Somebody I know told me they, like, just for me talking about this show, they told me they looked the show up and was watching the last episode with me. Oh, yeah, that's just a nightmare for you, huh? It is a nightmare for me. Oh, yeah. Well, um, that's too bad. Yeah, I'm glad you said we're just, we're, you know, we're just friends, huh? You just want to talk to your friend and, and get the thing, like, it's like the TV I show. Know, yeah, it's like I forget about the fact that this ends up being recorded. <laughs> yeah, you're just gone, gone and talking. That's what it should be. That's what, the, that's what we're, we're supposed to be doing here. But uh, we are watching live. Oh, there's only one person watching on YouTube right now. Yeah, Are you watching on YouTube? No. Oh, so there's one person live, but then there's a bunch of other people too. But we have been getting a lot of uh, like spam comments, so I wonder if like any of these people are even real. <laughs> like, mm. they might be like people I like find. I saw on some of the videos. There's like, there's, like I saw one video had a lot of like sexy. Uh, yeah, there's like they're like I I want hey I need a boyfriend, but then they there's like. They have this, like, string of emojis that I feel like is, like, some kind of code yeah. or something, like, afterwards. Maybe they're real. Oh, you're right. They, they, everybody, there's, like, ten really, really similar-looking uh, uh, singles in my area. <laughs> or whatever. <laughs> you know, it's like, if a single in my area was real and, and they messaged me, I wouldn't even know. How could I tell the difference between them and, like, the other... No, no, really, I'm a single in your area. I don't believe you. You know how many, like... No, this is real. Any. Huh? There has to be... There has to be some, uh, stranger singles who are trying to get you... To, to, trying to, <laughs> to find other strangers. Um... Can't hear you again. Well, I'm gonna try to call Mr. Ginsu. Hello? Oh, hello? Did oh. you hear what I said? No. I was saying there's some single woman out there who's taking that approach, you know, but no one's taking her seriously. They're, they're, they're emailing. No, they're like, they have their profile picture, like lingerie. <laughs> yeah. They're, they're messaging random people. Messaging like, random people things. saying that they're a single, yeah. I'm single yeah, no in the area. I'm looking seriously. For... No one's taking it seriously. Yeah. Why, why is nobody listening to me? I'm sexy. <laughs> right? Am I, what are you, I don't understand this. <laughs> They're like, <laughs> this is Mr. Gintu, if he answers. I don't think he's going to answer. Your call has been yeah. forwarded to an automatic voice message system. Getting... Three. So many. Oh. Zero, three, is not available. 
Mr. Gitchin's program, you can call us back. You have about 10 minutes, okay? Bye. Have a great night. I don't know why YouTube isn't filtering those comments, like... But we suddenly, like, got a lot of them. I don't know where they came from. We got, like, way more than before. Uh, is your... Uh, are you eating dinner with your family? Am I? Yes. Oh, oh, oh. Just in general. Yeah. No, we're a little too active for that. Hmm. No, um, f sit I, down. I, I roasted some broccoli tonight, and I ate my broccoli. Just by itself, or you have a side? Well, I just made it for my tofu, and then my mom threw it in her other tofu meal. I used it for my my tofu meal. She used it for her. They all vegetarians. Um, my mom is. My stepfather is not. He eats a lot of meat. But he eats it by himself. It's just me. He'll he'll call her to tofu froofy. Like Fru Fru? Oh. Like, like Fru Fru, yeah. Well, yeah. I don't I don't agree with it, but I wouldn't call it Fru Fru. I would just call it weird. I'm, I guess I'm going to call my grandmother because I got 10 minutes left. Okay. And then I'm going to uh, queue up the message to the future. Kenny. Hi, Grandma. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm okay. I think I'm my bad soul. Yeah. I think it's, huh? Yeah, probably. I think so. I think Andrew's working. I'm calling just to see how you're doing, though. Make sure you're drinking water, eat dinner, and stuff, okay? Yeah. Okay. Just a minute. I'm going to look at Okay. I don't think he's there, though. You got you got water out? Yeah. You do okay? Yeah, I'll be okay. Yeah. I yeah, think nobody here. Okay. So just on that, you will, he come back, he, he gonna call you back? Yeah, sure. Did you eat dinner? Huh? You gotta eat dinner, okay? Okay, then. Okay. I tell him to call you back, okay? That sounds good, okay. Okay, then thank you for calling. Take care of yourself. Okay, you too, okay, so bye. I'm gonna see you. Uh, maybe Sunday, I'm gonna see if Andrew's gonna give me a ride. Okay. Okay. Okay, then, this Sunday. See you Sunday, then. See you Sunday. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Your I don't know. I'm going to have some more peppy. Okay, okay. It's too late. I'm going to have some more peppy. I'm going to have some more peppy. I'm going to have some more She's been more peppy. It's like, she is not on a 24-hour cycle anymore. Like, she's, like, sleeping. Like, she's, like, napping and sleep, like, not... She's just like not doing a twenty-four. You know what I'm. You know what I'm she's saying. She's not playing by the. She's not playing by the rules. She's not playing by the rules. So it's like she's like sleeping like ten hours and then like waking up and being up for like two days and then going to sleep for two days and just like sleeping, and napping sometimes and just like up up and sleeping and because she doesn't do any, anything. Mm -hmm. Do do world events uh, um, stress her out at all? No. No. She does not know. She doesn't care. She doesn't know. That's she's kind of. Like, I was going to say maybe it's anxiety. Oh, no, it's not anxiety. She's probably drunk. Um, <laughs> but it's like... She's like... It's hard to tell if she's drunk. Like, one time we thought... Uh, like, she... We, I thought she was, you know, getting out of it in her mind, but then she was just drunk. But now she might be, but it's hard to tell. But it doesn't matter. She's always... Just, she's going to write... Whatever it's happening, she just, like, doesn't care. She's going to write it out anyway. So it's like something, it's hard to tell. But I think she, it's like when you catch her in her sleep cycle, because if, if she's going to be awake or not, and if she's been drinking, you know, it's like, you're going to be, you know, she's like, oh, we call her right in the sweet spot of, of drinking mm -hmm. or of sleeping, you know? Mm -hmm. So it's like hard uh, to tell. It's not, you know, it's like, did you just, did you, have you been awake long enough to be awake or you, you just drink a little bit or like, you know, mm -hmm. lots of factors. So she was just in the zone there. She was nice and warmed up. Yeah, she we caught her on a good time between like sleeping and drinking and eating or whatever. And I guess blood pressure. She's got like weird blood pressure. Lots oh, of stuff. She drink water. Uh, yeah, she got drink water. I'm always telling her to drink water because last time I went to the like, like she has gone to the hospital like more than once and they just told her that she's de severely dehydrated. Mm. Like she like loses consciousness, but they're like it's just because you're not drinking water enough. 
Hey, look at this, um, look at this. What is it, curtains? That sounds like a theater. Is, is it like a 3D illusion? Are you talking right now? It's, it's like a little kid painting of fish in a fishbowl. Yeah, did you do that? No, my sister did it. Wow. Are you... I've been feeling like, kind of like, uh, regressed in a way with this whole, like, quarantine thing. Because I'm like, not going anywhere and just like, watching a lot of TV and playing a lot of like, Nintendo. And like, eating, eating like, f like, frozen food. And... Not go and not doing anything. It's like what I was doing when I was a child. No, most adults. It's the uh, it's the aeon of the child. We're um we're we're li we're little boys and girls and and old. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I, but I was doing stuff for a long time. I was like doing everything, but now I'm back to just like staying home, which I think a lot of people were doing anyway. So, uh, here, here's the message of the future. Hey, future, touch the past. Hi, future. I have to go to bed soon because I have to go to work tomorrow morning. Well, y'all fellows out there on the farm making strong bullies. Mr. Ginsu is getting political. Grandma's in the sweet spot of being awake or drunk. Uh, okay, bye, future. Strong bullies. They, they don't have pizzas, though? They have them. Uh, is it, what's it, so what's the difference between a calzone? And a strong bully. I don't know. I'm living in wood work. Like everything, everywhere I go now is wood paneling. Every, like the restaurant I work in, the, everywhere it's wood. It's like <laughs> it's Twin Peaks. I kind of like it. Yeah, I mean, but is it like the '80s or before? I guess. Eight? No, it's it's an '80s. It was built in the '80s. The restaurant. Yeah, yeah it's everything's. Very, it's very clean though. Like. Was that an '80s thing? Wood. In in the eighties, everything was wood. Like even like they put like wood on the fridge, like laminated. They like oh. laminated things in wood, like fake wood. I like it. Like even like you know like like uh, cars, like even like um. Yeah. But that wasn't real wood. They just like put wood, like a laminate over the I cars. I don't know um, why. I like that. I like I like that people were doing that though. It's like maybe in like the. Sixties, everything was supposed to be futury, and then they went back to wood, or like plastic or something. Plastic got real big, and then they were like, "Oh, how about wood?" Yeah, the farm seems like it could be the eighties or something to me. I feel like I'm in a time warp. Yeah, that's so crazy. It's a big like, just like weird. It's like a change, but it's like a backwards change. Hey, yeah, it's, it's good. It's good. I, I was gonna. It wasn't going to be good in Philly if I stayed there, so I'm liking this. Yeah. Such a weird time. Yeah, yeah, we had, like, this, like, the, uh, Hayakuba, I don't know, I think, I don't, we haven't talked to you since, we talked to you the day before, but now we're, like, on the other side of it, and... Yeah, I wanted to come back, because I didn't want you to think I was just tuning in for the big hurrah there. Yeah, uh, yeah, <laughs> I think you lessen. I think some other people I would accuse them of doing that, but um, now it's like we're on the other side of it, and it's like uh, but I didn't think like, who would have thought that like we would have been here when that happened? Like for years, I was kind of like, oh, in the big ten year thing, we're gonna be doing stuff, but it's like we ended up mm -hmm. just like. It's it's yeah, it's it's also wild that you started at the beginning of a decade. And end it at the, you know, that it's like 2010, 2020. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the start of this decade, end of the last, is taking but place we like, in the middle of this insane turmoil. It's like almost like it feels kind of like that 10 years ago that I knew this was going to happen in 10 years. So like, oh, you know, when you, it's 10, you're going to be right in the middle of it. Or if I knew that I was going to make mm -hmm. it this far either. Uh, but yet. What what do we have to show for the time? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what do we have? What do we have to do? Uh, it's not like we have the answers here. Well, yeah, we do. So. I don't know, but the show's about over. We got about two minutes left. So I yeah, thanks uh, y'all. Thanks for being here today. Thanks to Freddie for the message and Mr. Ginsu and Grandma. I have to go to bed. Bye bye.
Good night. Good night. Call back. Release some messages. Yeah. Okay, bye. Say your prayers. Yeah, say your prayers. Oh. Pray to call. Uh, well, thanks, everybody. We almost made it. Go to go see. What do uh, deer eat? Flowers? How many flowers are there? Are they eating anything? Well, what about oh, what about the sea bugs though? I should ask Yellowfellow about sea bugs, but I guess we were talking about other things. We didn't have time to talk about the sea bugs. Maybe the sea bugs is more of a thing that I've got to think about for myself and not about what uh, Yellowfellow is thinking about them. I'm going to finish out this Mr. Ginsey message. I, I paused it in the middle of it. If you got sorry, if you don't have coronavirus, but you're stressed out from it, you don't have to pay. Um, I originally heard. If you have coronavirus, then you don't have to pay. But now it's morphed into you just don't have to pay. Um, yeah, that's really not working. It's not working. You owe that money. And what happens whenever the people who ain't paying are subletting this is a fucking place? I don't know if they're getting paid, but they got more people coming in and coming out and moving in and moving out from what I hear. It's like, what the what? I mean, we got no recourse. We can't harass them or nothing because otherwise we're bad people if we start harassing them. Hard to tell. Hard to say, hard to say. Uh, aren't the people who move in supposed to pay? <laughs> uh, yeah. We never gave no permission for nobody else to move in, but they're moving in anyway. Uh-oh. Uh, what's up with that? Yeah, it's not good. So, I don't know what to tell you, but... Thanks for watching. It's Wednesday. We're on TCTV, channel 22, 1130 and 2am. Check it out here. What is it? Dot com. 364, call me a message. Get on TV. 198 Avenue, number 3. Check it out. Yeah. Yeah. Fun series. A good song. Thank you. TCTV, La Baby, Jody Fabos, Graham Graham, Sussex Black Hunter, Olympus, Chris Chow, Watch the USA, thank you, and viewers, as you're watching, thank you. Hell yeah, dog! Sha! Bye!